Hello my lovely Aquarius. How are you loves? I hope everybody's well. Aquarius today will do your daily read for the 3rd and the 4th of October. As you know, this is a general read. My resonate loves with you, my not. Take the message accordingly to your situation and leave what not. If you're inclined by the title, it's here a message for you. So let's see here what we got for your overall energy for today and see what brings the storyline for you, loves. For my dear Aquarians. All right, loves. In your overall energy, we got the Knight of Swords. This is you, loves. What's bothering you here? It's kind of like... I want to do this. It's my way. I know I got to do it. It's just like you tend to rush some things, but you're not really aware how that will go. As always, you know me, loves. I always said do not rush into any things because it might get the opposite ways. For some of you, you might have some arguments with somebody or misunderstandings or different opinions. Try to not rush into conclusions, whatever this person has or anything like that. But I definitely see here is a fast movement energy. For some of you, you might think of a situation and you feel like, why is not going faster? Why is taking so slow? I don't get it. It's just like you don't get why this happens. It could be easier than just this. Yeah? And death. Scorpio energy here. Some of you might be very angry that something is ending. But believe it or, believe it or not, after a door closed, a window is opening. We have two of swords, six of pentacles, two of wands, ten of pentacles, empress, and magician, queen of pentacles, king of pentacles, and the hierophant. All right, loves. I definitely see here some of you might have some communication issues here. Somebody needs to apologize in a situation here. Absolutely. Somebody really needs to make some plans going forward. For some of you, you might not talking with your partner because I definitely see here you are coupled here. It is a 3D couple. Queen of Pentacles and King of Pentacles. I feel here you are back to back for a reason. If I'll say like this, you are at the same page, but I see you back to back. You might not talking or whatever talk it's kind of they are blockages in your communication also i definitely see here for some of you is a third person here you might not really be aware aquarius about that third per person or something is in balance regarding um baby father baby mother here because in extending here we have the aquarius which is you loves this is you, my, my loves. You might be the third party. But I definitely see here it is a child in the picture. You might be in love with somebody who is married. You might offer them something. Or you might want to walk away towards somebody else here. There are two storylines here. Somebody really needs to make a decision here. Do I stay in this situation? Or do I move forward? But the decision, it is on your side, loves. Yeah? And why is this energy of Knight of Swords? is like you don't get it. If you are the third party, and I definitely see here you are single here, you don't understand if these two, if they're not talking, if they don't get along, why they stay in this commitment? Yeah, I feel here it is an earth sign strongly and a water sign. And you, loves. 
but what I'm feeling here, you are single and you are the third party. What you need to do is a decision which you don't you refuse basically to make it or the person you are dealing refuses here whatever this person is offering you is small yeah whatever you offering is too much and you just like about to walk away to move towards something else i don't feel you fulfilled if you are married or committed with somebody aquarius you want to walk away because you you not really feel fulfilled whatever you are. If you are the third party, you want to walk away towards something else. Because you are not feeling fulfilled whatever you are. But I definitely see you single here. See you single, abundant, good, gracious. And definitely you might deal with a baby father, baby mama. And you want to have a family with this person. Also, the Empress is one of the cards of a twin flame energy. You might feel, I want to commit with this person, but first they need to break up or something like that. For some of you, you might have kids with this person or they have kids. Because I definitely see here kids involved here. You do love this person. You want this person, but for some reason, something is not getting along here. Why this two of swords here? For some of you, you didn't know that the person you are dealing is coupled or married. And they could be separated, not living together or something at that extent. If you are male, divine masculine, and de deal with a female here, the person she is committed, that person still wants to have that commitment. She doesn't. But she refused to leave the family just because of money or stability or because they seems to look like a power couple. But let's see here, this two of swords, nine of wands, and the star, this is you, loves. You want this person, but you don't really know how to proceed forward. Six of Pentacles, Lovers, somebody needs to make a decision, which I feel here is you, because Lovers is Gemini, but you have a decision to make. Do you want to stay in this, or do you want to move forward? Do you want to choose what is good for you, or you want to stay here in this third party? Definitely it's a third party, I don't really like to talk about it, but... I definitely see here you absolutely love this person. They might see you as a friend or you might be a family member or a family friend for this person. Yeah. What's the decision? Let's see here two of wands. Why the decision is about three of swords. Absolutely is a third party. For some of you, you are very much hurt. That this person is not really leaving the marriage or whatever is out there. Or whatever commitment they have. And High Priestess. You know, Piscean energy here. You know that you... It's kind of like I'm feeling here, Aquarius. You are the secret person for this person. And they do not reveal to their partner. You know... It's kind of like you secretly hurt or you keep all the hurt for yourself. And you know this person will not leave that person. Yeah. For some of you, yes. You are the third party, but I definitely see here the universe is moving you forward. I definitely see here for some of you, Especially for those of you who are the third party here. You are just fine financially. You are awesome. But you just kind of very much conflicted deep inside you. Why this cannot go forward? Because you do love each other. You do love this person. But I definitely see here, yes, you do love this person with all your heart. You feel they are your twin flame. But this person... You are dealing, they feel you are a very good friend. 
it's not like necessary that I love you with all my heart and you are the main thing here, no. I definitely see here you are suffering in silence and you know you need to make a decision regarding this situation. Cannot go any longer this way. I definitely see here an Aquarius who is single and is part of a third party. And I definitely see here the universe is moving you forward and is telling you to put this because it looks like a burden. It's just one-sided relationship. And I definitely see here you moving forward and you still hoping that you'll have another life here or another partner. And I definitely see here it is somebody there for you. I, I don't really feel you taking it necessary. But I definitely see here it is something new could emphasize. But you are too hurt to go right away. I definitely see here will be healing in this case, but you need you need time because I don't feel you are really much speaking those feelings or you share with anybody those feelings because I definitely see here you are single and you are the third body. Flee the energy, Aquarius, but I, I feel here the person you are dealing, they are not here to leave the family. Or if you are dealing and somebody is a third party for you, you will not leave this marriage. I don't feel this person is leaving their partner, no. Even they are having misunderstanding, not really get along. I feel here you will be the one who will leave here, this situation. So Aquarius, I definitely see here movement forward and it is a very good potential for something new. Just keep your eyes open, keep an open minded because there is something better for you. And yes, loves, we'll see you tomorrow. And again, we have a Pisces, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, could be Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and a Gemini, I see, or a fellow air sign. So, loves, this is what I got for you, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.